yeah welcome back today so today i'm going to talk on uh, integration by part integration by part using what using the shortcut so we are to use what di method which is a uh, differentiation and integral method for solving integration by part of the form n x raised to power of n then f of x where f of x is what trigonometric function that is sine and cos only not star sine and cos and what an exponential function that is your f of x may be what may be sine cos or what or exponential function why your x is what algebra function so if you are given such integration and you have to find the integral where your f of x is sine or cos and you are you are and you are having what you are having algebra function so you can use this di method we which i'm going to treat here today so let's start from uh, number one here we have number one as uh, the integral of x where sine 2 x dx so your d that is your differentiation your differential will be what? Your differential will be u. Check my video on how to choose u and v. So you choose this as your u. So your algebra function will be your what? Your algebra function will be your d here. So you bring it down. Here. Square. Then you differentiate again. You have 2x. Continue to differentiate. You have 0. Then differentiate this one. You have 2. Differentiate this one. You have 0. So you bring this, you start differentiation, different, uh, integrating, sorry, you start integrating this one, that is your i. So you integrate this, integrate this, you have 1 minus cos 2x over 2. Then you integrate this, you have what? Minus sine 2x over 4. Then you integrate this, you have what? Plus cos 2x over 8. Then you have what? If you get to this 0, you have dash. Just dash it. So now you want now add plus minus plus minus. The reason why we have plus minus is that from our integration by part formula we have integral of u dv equals to u v minus uh, integral of uh, v du. Find out that we have positive before negative. So that's why we use it in this manner. Plus negative plus negative. So plus times negative, yeah, we have negative that is multiply this one together, multiply this one together, multiply this one together, multiply this one together. So here we have what? We have minus cos 2x over 2. So here if we multiply this one together, we'll find out that these two are uh, this four as reduced and these two has cancelled out. Negative multiplied by negative, we have positive. And we have x sine 2x over 2. So here again, you find out that this is plus plus. This one has also cancelled, and this one has reduced to four. So we have plus cos two x over four plus your plus your c. So this is your answer. First, so you can now intend to what to factor out one over two here. Can factor out one two as what one over two to bracket to minus cos two x here plus uh, sine two x. Then here plus cos 2x over 2. So plus c. So that's your answer for that. So the next one again we have what? Number 2. We have integral of x raised to the power of 3 and exponential 2x dx. So you choose your d again. Your d here again is what? Is the algebraic function. So you bring it down. Then you start differentiating. Then you differentiate this again. Then you differentiate this again. Then you differentiate constant, which is zero. So you integrate this. That is integral. Integrate this. Start by integrating this first and bring it down. Don't just bring it down as you do here. Start integrating it from here. So we have what? Exponential 2x. Over two that is integral of this. Check my video on integration by use of position. I do I did all this type here how to integrate this type of function. So this integrate this one to have this one you enter 2x over what over 4. So you integrate this one to your exponential 2x over 8, then integrate this one to your what exponential 2x 
over 1 over 16 plus 1 and 0 here dash just dash it you get to this place just dash it or you have is zero because we multiply it again so you multiply it again it will be zero so now multiply these two together at this first firstly put your sign plus minus plus minus so your sign here we've got positive multiply by positive we have positive so we have what x is to the power of three exponential two x over two so you have what here you have uh, minus this negative is here plus by positive positive here so you have three x square exponential two x over four so here you have positive 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 so here you can reduce this since you are multiplying it together and you reduce this this is two in six you have three so you have four so you have a uh, three x exponential two x over four so here too you have the negative here positive is here so you have positive and negative which is negative so you have uh, reduce these two you have 36 multiply by 1 over 16 you do more you what you reduce it you have what 2 here we got 3 by 2 here we got 8 so you have uh, 3 exponential 2x over 8 plus c so that's your answer for this have a look so simple and so and so what and so fast so try to have a look have a look check it then you do what you try to test yourself with this number uh, three test yourself with this integration that is your test test your work self with this integrators x squared plus 3x just follow the same procedure as you uh, follow me on how i solve this one follow the same pro procedure just bring your different function here continue to differentiate it to, to you have what till you have zero then bring start differentiating this one uh, integrating this one integrate this one you have this integrate this one you have this integrate this one you have this then integrate this one yeah in, if you integrate this one you put it here you know you multiply it by zero so you just dash it don't integrate it then what then put your sign plus minus plus minus then do what then multiply them together and reduce that's it so thank you have a look have a nice day if this seems to be helpful please try to subscribe for more shortcuts videos thank you thank you for watching